members and welcome to this conference and to the city of Burgos. On the screen now you will see a picture that I see every day. This is a painting, a painting sitting opposite my desk in the city hall. And it is a painting from the mid-50s of what we in Burgos call the Southern Square. From the beginning, a marketplace where the farmers from surrounding villages took their vegetables to sell to the inhabitants of the city. Today, we have it as a hub for our local bus traffic, meaning that you take the bus from your suburb, you change there and you go further on. But I think this picture, the picture of the square, is actually the picture we should have when we discuss development methods. Because on the square, people meet. IDs, transports. You go there for a purpose, you go there for the purpose to be stronger, to learn something new. And I think that is actually what we're talking about here. Can we find places where we can meet, where we can transfer IDs, where we can communicate? Then we will take the giant leap for the progression. So imagine a square. We can call it the textile cluster. But imagine the square. On one side of the square we have the tradition. Here in Boros we have the peddler trading traditions. We have the textile industries, production traditions for 150 years. We have the mail order business. Maybe we call it logistics today. But all this tradition in people but also in memories. We have a, as a very clear view of that is our textile museum or the Nordic Library of Textiles, which are gathered here. Consider that to be one side of our square. On the second side, we have the more modern, creative industry, the more knowledge-based industry. We have here in Boros the National School for Textiles on the University College of Boros. We have the Technical Research Institute of Sweden here in Boros. We have this project called Smart Textiles. We have the cultural part that lifts up ideas, design, fashion. See that as the other, the second side of the square. On the third side, we have, of course, all our cooperators, all people we would like to interact with, whether you come from Sweden or from Australia or from Bangladesh or from whatever country or whatever activities that are interesting. You are a part of this square. Let them wander from these sides into the square and see where we can meet. See where we can find IDs. See, for example, the giant designer who have studied at the textile, the school of textile, who can wander into this square and uh, meet with someone saying, I know how you should put your new collection into production in my home country. We can walk to work together with that. We can move on to find someone say, I know how you can, who, are, who you can get distribution on this collection through our mail order system or e-business system. Somewhere when we need, we find solutions and therefore we need those meeting places. Or take the innovator who can walk into this square and say, hey, I have a great idea here. Who is interested in taking that to the next step or to buy it from me or to buy just an item? Or uh, take the student who are going to write his or her thesis who can walk back to the Nordical Library of Textiles and say, oh, this is how the pattern looked at the farmer society late 19th century. Can I take up something from that? Can I feel this unique material and take something into my new things from that? All we walk to this square and we take off from this square in the same direction because the fourth side is obviously the future. The future towards where we all head. The future towards which all our ideas actually aim. New businesses, new ideas, a better future. Or is it so 
that uh, next textile, this conference, we are actually a stand on this square. As the logo sign, you can say there are either a part calling next, the red line, or a part calling textile, the blue line. Somewhere they meet in a cross. They meet as a meeting point. We meet there to see what can we take further from this. When my wife and I was to be married, we got a little, little card. Just like a business card, on which is what's printed uh, in Swedish, but I take it in English. Love is not to look each, each other deeply in the eyes, but to look towards the future with common eyes. And I think that is actually what we are looking forward to today. To, well, we may very much be fell in love and look into each other's eyes, but we need to go further together towards common uh, goals. We need to look to the future with common eyes because then we have a cooperation, then we have a way on. So, this vision, this square, you can call it just a vision. But here in Boros it has a name, because we are now in the process of developing an old industrial area, 60,000 square meters, into a modern place where we physically can place all these activities. We can invite you from all your activities to take part. We will have the textile museum there, we will have the schools of textile, we will have the possibility to have an exchange or to have a trading place all together in one building, and we call it Simon's Land. And I hope that I could invite you all in about three years to take part of that development, because it is not just a vision for us, it's a reality. And the city of Boros, together with the University of Boros, together with all the inhabitants of Boros, has said, this is what we shall achieve. We invite you all to take part in that development. So, the next time, I hope we will meet there, because being a textile city as Boros has been, it has been a very dark time. The textile moved abroad, and it was a bit dull, it was not so very glamorous to be here. But we have decided, we need to act on whatever resources we have. We need to connect together. The possibilities all these 103,000 citizens of Boros, with all their colleagues or friends around the world, can create in order to form this arena where we meet to discuss textile, but to move together towards the future. And in that sense, I would like to welcome you all to these sessions, to this next textile. The place where the blue screen and the red screen meets in a cross, and from that point we move further together. Very welcome to Boros, very welcome to this conference, and hope we meet again, because then it means that the development continues. Very welcome.